Now, Way 31 Storm Tracker Meteorologist Amber Kulin with 31 Triple Doppler. Let's talk about this weather we're expecting tomorrow mm. night. I mean, I love the fact that we're going to get to enjoy some sunshine for a couple of yeah. days, but we can't risk anything there either. I know, yeah. More storms on the horizon as we head into tomorrow night. So let's go ahead and get right over to our next weather maker here. Cold front settles in as we head into your Friday night, into your Saturday morning. That's going to bring rain and storms with it. And there will be that risk of some strong to severe thunderstorms as this rolls through the area. So let's start off with your severe weather outlook for tomorrow. This is for Friday night. This goes in until 6 a.m. on Saturday morning. Now the best chance of severe weather will stay to our north, but they have upped it just a little bit for us across the Tennessee Valley. If you're in the yellow color, that's Huntsville, Athens, Decatur, Moulton, Muscle Shoals. That's a slight risk or a level two. And the green color from Fault Full, Coleman, Gunnersville, Scottsboro, Fort Payne. That's that marginal risk or that level one risk of seeing strong to severe thunderstorms. And like I said, this goes until 6 a.m. on Saturday morning. Chances are we will still have storms ongoing across the Tennessee Valley at that time, which is why we're in that marginal risk of seeing some stronger thunderstorms on Saturday. This is just for Saturday morning because after that line moves through, it looks like we'll be dry for the rest of the day. Speaking of that, let's go ahead and time it out for you. We'll start off today because we're not going to see a whole lot through the afternoon hours today. Day, mix of sun and clouds for the rest of your Thursday. As we head into the overnight hours tonight, we'll keep the cloud cover with us starting off tomorrow morning. We're dry, we're quiet, but it's tomorrow night when we'll start to see that line of showers and thunderstorms move in. As early as 1, 2 o'clock in the morning, th this will be coming from the north, so it's going to hit places like Hazel Green, Athens, and Killen first and make its way down through the rest of the area. So here's what we could be seeing at 4 a.m. on your Saturday morning. Line of showers and thunderstorms pushing south across the Tennessee Valley will continue all the way through 5, 6 o'clock in the morning before it finally clears the area. Like I said, rest of the day on Saturday looks really good as we head into Saturday night could pick up some more showers and then on Sunday more scattered rain across the Tennessee Valley not expecting severe weather by then. So this is going to be a conditional severe weather event. There's a chance that we could see severe weather. There's a chance we won't see severe weather. One thing is it's coming in during the overnight hours. Another is we will see a cap in the atmosphere. That's an area of some warmer temperatures aloft and storms don't like that. But if they can break through that, that's when we could see some stronger thunderstorms with gusty winds, some large hail, tornado threat, not zero, but it's not high with this event as it moves through the area. So it is something we will continue to keep an eye on as we head into tomorrow. Make sure you keep checking back for those updates. Right now, 31 triple Doppler, relatively quiet. We do have one area of a few sprinkles moving through DeKalb County, but for the rest of us, we're quiet. We'll stay that way through the rest of the day today. Across the southeast right now, much quieter than what we've seen over the past couple of days, but that will all change as we head into tomorrow. Temperatures warming up right now. We're at 81 in Muscle Shoals, 76 in Huntsville, 75 in Decatur, and we'll continue to warm into the 80s for afternoon highs today. Warmest day of the week so far will stay in the 80s as we move towards the weekend. Next week, another cold front will move through. Looks like it's going to cool us down a little bit back into the 70s for afternoon highs. Stay with us. We'll be right back.